Hello and welcome back to the channel. Today we have another exciting DIY project for you. We will learn and build an industrial robot, also known as an automated warehouse system. Get ready to make your own simple factory. Industrial robots or automated warehouse systems are advanced technological solutions designed to optimize the storage, retrieval and movement of goods within warehouse and distribution system. These systems leverage various automated technologies such as robotics, conveyor belts and software algorithms to enhance efficiency, accuracy and productivity in the warehouse operations. The usage could range from inventory management to order fulfillment, storage optimization or material handling. The possibilities are endless. So without any further delay, let us get started. First, we will gather all the necessary components required to build our conveyor belt. We will need 4 12.5 inch U-beams, 2 12.5 inch L-channels, 4 2.5 inch U-beams, 1 2.5 inch square plate, 1 7.5 inch rectangular plate, 2 5.5 inch axle, 1 2.5 inch flexi strip, 4 big wheels, 2 high speed motors, 1 IR sensor, 1 BLE full 2.0 brain, 5 connecting cables, 1 nut and bolt pack, 1 gift or chart paper for the conveyor belt. Now let us start building the mechanism of the conveyor belt. Now that we've got the mechanism all set up, I'll grab some chart paper or gift wrap and use tape to fasten it into a belt. After that, we'll wrap this belt around both the wheels of the conveyor mechanism. With our conveyor belt mechanism good to go, our next step is to construct the support structure on the open end. On top of this structure, we'll mount the IR sensors using flexi strips along with the full 2.0 BLE brain. Our conveyor belt mechanism is good to go. So let us test it out. Now let's build the robotic arm to bring the industrial bot to life. We will require the following components to build the robotic arm. One 7.5 inch L channel, two 7.5 inch U beams, six 2.5 inch square plates, five 2.5 inch U beams, three 3.5 inch axles, 10 small rubber bands, one big gear, three medium gears, three connecting tables, one nut and bolt pack and two high torque motors. Let's start by building the base of the robotic arm, which will provide stability to the entire structure.
Now let us build the grabbing mechanism of the arm which will help in picking up the objects from the conveyor belt. The robotic arm is ready. Let's see it in action. Before we code the industrial robot, let us understand how it works. The conveyor belt continuously moves. And when the IR sensor detects an object, the belt stops. Simultaneously, the robotic arm picks up the object and places it in the designated area. Once the sensor detects no object, the conveyor belt resumes its motion and the arm returns to its original position. For this to function, we will place the robotic arm right in front of the IR sensor so the grabbing mechanism and the conveyor belt mechanisms work in sync. Now that we've put together all parts of the industrial bot, our next step is to write the code that makes the conveyor belt and robotic arm work together. To code the industrial bot, I will be using the Avishkar AMS AI app on the web platform. You can also use the Avishkar AMS app to code the robot on your smartphone or tablet. Here's a snapshot of the code. Feel free to pause the video for a closer look. And there you have it, your very own industrial bot. From building to code, all its functions, we've covered it all. If you're eager to dive deeper into robotics, check out our Avishkar kits. They include everything you need for your next project and beyond. Thanks for joining us today. If you enjoyed this project, give it a thumbs up and let us know in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe for more exciting projects just like this. Until next time.